Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm at the kitchen table, but I want to do this video and I've been super pumped because, well, it's taken me some time to get this full collection. And uh, Vegas Golden Knights have won the Stanley Cup and throughout the playoffs, I've been accumulating one puck from each round. Well, this is my latest pickup and ironically, it was the very first game we played. I had to call True North, which is in Canada, Winnipeg, and they hooked it up. They had one left, they held it literally on hold for me for like four or five days. And then I paid the invoice and then like a week later it was shipped. So shout out to the True North store. This is also a certified puck stating that it was officially warm up used. That's the one thing I do like about these. Not all the pucks will do this. Uh, this was round one, game four. The theme here is every single puck you'll see, Vegas has won that game. So this was round one, and uh, this is my latest pickup. It's the very first round, of course, but in kind of backwards. So, but I was happy to have it. So that's the first one. Then we go over to Edmonton versus, excuse me, um, yeah, no, Edmonton Oilers versus Vegas, round two, game five. The one thing about this puck is although it's not graded and certified or you know doesn't even have a case it doesn't matter to me it's all part of the memory the magical run being a vegas golden knights fan and just having this in the collection looking back is going to be an amazing memory on top of betting vegas to win the cup back in october hitting that futures bet also paid for you know a lot of these pucks which is cool because uh you know all around a budget just like the channel we're always looking for deals trying to find things at the right price and of course we did now this one i paid closer this is probably the most expensive i paid for a puck i bought this from the vegas team store so that was around a hundred dollars this is uh such a dogfight series but you don't see very many of the Oilers pucks, and you really don't see any more of these anymore. At one point on eBay, you could snipe these up. I paid 50 plus shipping, so $60, but like they're now looking close to 300. You know, a couple hundred bucks, people want for them. You could still find a deal out there here and there. But anyways, just, you know, my thing is on this channel, if you're new here, I always talk about, you know, I always talk about finding uh, a good entry point. And if you are a seller, maybe you get your money back one day. To me, this is going to hold a lot of value long-term because these pucks are actually very rare to find. Warm-up pucks are only made per game and they only make a limited supply. So there could be 50 of these pucks made per game. Well, you think, well, if they Vegas beat them in five, do the math, guys, there's not that many. This is from the Dallas series. This is also signed off by the CEO stating that it was officially used as a warm-up puck. I like the cases, I like these, like I said, but you're not always gonna have that luxury of finding one like this. This here, I paid under $100 for, and I've seen people on eBay trying to jack the prices up. It took me a while to find the best possible deals, but I did, and uh, I'm super pumped to share it with you guys, and I hope you guys enjoy this as much as I do, because this is the first time I've seen the full set in a video, in a picture, in person. And uh, shout out to the guy in the Vegas, um, the Vegas uh, Golden Knights group for sending me that link from Fanatics about the, uh, the puck holders. I'm really thinking about something like that, or I'm just thinking about picking up a couple more of these. So thank you for that. But uh, this is the third round. This was another round or another game in the third round, game three. And of course we won. That was my theme was always to try to buy a winning puck in the game that we won, which we did win this game. And uh, it was a pretty big blow up that game. And then of course we go to game, excuse me, round four, game four, which is the Stanley Cup. This, this was from Florida. The guy at the game got it for me. And uh, you know, Florida is tricky because they started bringing out more warm up pucks that weren't actually used. But I made sure to get one that was used. And if you can tell, there are scratches on it from the game. So be careful. Um, 
at this point it doesn't matter anymore because you can't even get a, a warm-up puck from Florida without paying at least 100 plus 200 I've been seeing them go for 300 even though they may not have been technically used they're still from the cup which has a lot of significance this full set together to the right collector definitely can bring over a thousand like I said there's individual pucks online right now that are pricey I'm not selling this if I were to sell it you know it would be over that probably that dollar amount but I am if you're if you guys are new here you know I'm, I'm like a big time collector you can see all my other videos and um, you can see we're always building things for the collection pieces that we believe in and also that have a lot of significance so this is a this is a magical year for Vegas and especially you know winning it in Vegas this this game four here was in Florida Vegas Team Store hasn't released any pucks for sale from the warm-up as far as the Florida series. I did snipe up that Oilers puck from the store, and they actually sent me the wrong puck, and shout-out to the Vegas Team Store because you guys hooked it up and let me keep the other warm-up. Uh, it was a matchup puck against Edmonton, so I got a free puck. So I was really happy about that. But, yeah, once again, guys, Game 4, Stanley Cup. We have Game 3 against the Dallas Stars. Round three. Round two, right? Game five against the Oilers from the Vegas team store. And then my last pickup from the first round from the True North, Winnipeg. And uh, I really do like the official warm-up pucks. I like how they sign off. Uh, it doesn't look as handwritten as the one in Dallas, but I like the case. And this is history, and for you collectors out there, you'll know something. You'll realize, like, you know, Vegas Golden Knights, this will be the first complete set and that we won, right, the cup. I've seen other sets online that are pushing a 1,000, but that we've lost. So getting to the cup is significant, right? It's huge. And um, this set, to me, means more since we won, and that's why I want to make sure I found it. At a good deal because I always talk about on this channel buying at the right price and uh, entry point and if you are gonna sell a worst case scenario you want to get your try to get your money back and these these molds I'm showing you here I personally made for my collection if you are a Vegas Golden Knights fan or if you like any of these molds I will send them ship to you for uh, 25 bucks 25 bucks around they're pure copper they're pretty heavy and they take time to make uh, let me know if you guys want any of these, I only have a few left, but uh, I'll just give them at a discount for all my Vegas people out there who might be interested in something like that. Once again, guys, thank you for watching. I was so pumped to, to finally get this set. I literally started buying these in the playoffs, but I was only buying them at decent prices, like those outrageous prices we see on eBay right now. I wasn't really picking those up. Uh, one, I couldn't afford it, and two, it's not how I do, you know, my strategy with collecting and investing. But for the most part, thank you guys for watching. And uh, hit that subscribe button, hit the like button, and comment below. Go Knights, go.